Hello, I, I'm uh, James Ao Yong and um, currently I'm in Estic Clinic. So one of the questions which I get is uh, what's my take on guys doing injectables? So when I get a question right, I'm, I, I'm always thinking like, why not? I mean, uh, everyone do have the rights, right? I mean, in terms of wanting to look young, wanting to look youthful, regardless of our gender or even age. So, but more importantly, I feel the key thing is not to overdo things. If it's just for a good reason of maintenance, right? Yeah, why not? What are some of the major concerns which I face? I think one of the key things is in terms of uh, my forehead I tend to have um, a lot of wrinkles when I frown yeah. So the other key things would be the cheeks because I naturally have a sunken cheek so even if I get enough of rest right um, it will still kind of have a bit of sunken looking yeah, which I'm not so comfortable with lah. and last but not least it will be the jawline yeah correct so it tends to be very profound and uh, I like to shape it down a bit lah. so basically what are some of the benefits which I feel the cheek fillers would actually help I think most key thing is it gives a much more fuller contour to my entire face so technically I'll look more youthful <laughs> and not forgetting I mean the Botox um, can help to get rid of my line and also give me a more defined jaw so now I'm with um, Dr. Celine and have a couple of questions which I have for her. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Celine Leong from Aesthetic Clinic. So hi Dr. Celine, I uh, just want to find out a bit more right? what are some of the injectables commonly done by guys? Okay, I do notice that over the past few years mm. there are more and more male patients coming forward for aesthetic treatments. So commonly in the past, they were more of in the age group of about 40s to 50s whereby they were looking for injectables like Botox to reduce their wrinkles due to aging for example you know around the front lines mm. and around the crow's feet area but i do notice that in more recent years um, younger patients have come up to me looking not just for wrinkle reduction but also other things like facial feature enhancement so not just in female patients the male patients are actually catching on in to wanting to define their jawline with a reduction of the masseter as well as um, fillers to enhance even their chin the jawline itself and other facial features such as the nose the cheekbones basically anywhere that a female wants to do the male patients also are catching on on that actually most of them have minimal to no downtime they usually involve an injection of fillers or botox using very very fine needles and so many of my patients come during their lunchtime hours or after work or on the weekends in fact i find that male patients generally the skin are quite resilient so the bruising and downtime is actually quite minimal for them as well okay as of all treatments there are always um, side effects be it minor to more major but rare side effects so as a doctor i always explain clearly to my patients the commoner side effects which are minor usually some bruising a bit of swelling a bit of soreness on the injected areas um, but the rare ones normally we, we do discuss a little bit and usually patients uh, after taking an informed consent most of them always proceed to do Okay, so I'm done with the treatment. You can see it's instant results around my cheek area and there's no downtime at all. Dr. Celine is very gentle and thoughtful throughout the entire process. Yep, she's concerned whether do I feel any aches or pains, which I totally don't. So that, that's a plus point of doing the procedure in this clinic.